this is Susan. I have a um, cake for you today. This is an apple cake. Uh, I'm going to have the ingredients are listed for you, so I'm just going to tell you a little bit of how to make it. Uh, the first thing you do, you preheat your oven to 350, and then you uh, grease the base in the size of a a 9 inch spring foam pan with oil or with butter or with spray, whichever you prefer. And you put that in a standby mixer with a uh, paddle attachment to it. Not the thin one, but the paddle attachment. And you mix the vegetable oil and the sugar, or gradually the sugar and a brown sugar until it's well mixed in that bowl in your electric mixer. And you add one uh, bowl, or one egg at a time. And once mixed, you add the vanilla. And in a separate bowl, you whisk the flour and baking soda, cinnamon, salt, and nutmeg. With a mixer on, stir the dry ingredients into the wet ingredients until it's well incorporated. Then you can mix in some uh, chopped pecans and uh, about three cups of diced apples. I use Granny Smith. And you spread that their uh, batter into a spring foam uh, pan. And you bake it for 45 or 50 minutes, or until a toothpick comes out clean. And then you put a caramel sauce on it. And the way you make that, in a medium saucepan over medium heat, you whisk together the brown sugar, butter, heavy cream, vanilla, and salt, and bring it to a low boil, and continue to cook, stirring gently for about three minutes, and it'll start getting thick. And when after it gets thick, and it cools down a little bit, I like for mine to cool down a little bit. You cool down a little bit, and let your cake cool down, then you just drip it over top of your cake. This, I'll have to do this this way, okay? It's very easy to make. good. Uh, actually, it's more I need it, really. But, uh, I'm going to put it all on there so it's uh, cold for it. I hate to do it this way, but I have to. I've got it right here in the window so I can have it some light so you can see it better. Well, that's it. And it turned out great. And I know it's going to be good. Now that is my recipe for today. Everything will be wrote down for you. I want to thank you for watching. I want to thank all my supporters. And I'll see you down the road one of these days.